The Imperial County Office of Education organized the Innovation Day conference and invited local teachers and administrators to enjoy a day filled with new ideas and inspiration. This year, the spotlight of the conference was on STEM, science, technology, engineering, and math. The question was, what is it that teachers need, to, need as their takeaway message? And the takeaway message today is we want to teach not facts, but we want to teach students how to think, and second, how to be innovative in their thinking. As we think about where we want children to be in the future, it's not children who know the facts who are going to be successful, but kids who are flexible with how I connect those facts with new opportunities and new inventions in the future. I think it's essential that teachers learn to um, implement implement uh, integration into the classroom because it's students really do learn from making those connections and if we just memorize facts I think we're missing the point. Um, the United States has the edge as I mentioned earlier because we are good at encouraging creativity and innovation and our students um, can do so much. We don't have to have all the answers. It's important for us to be the experts but yet to use that expertise to help our students to explore and make discoveries and connections on their own. The most important reason it's important for teachers to innovate is because the way kids learn is different now. Um, the way that they consume information is different than the way our teachers learned how to consume information when, when they were learning, when we're learning. Um, and so if we don't move with the times, uh, we're going to be leaving kids behind. So the biggest, th the biggest challenge is to make sure that uh, the way kids access, process, and disseminate information is changing. And if we don't keep up with it, then it'll be tough. I have to say it's, it's like a revolution because, like, last year I wasn't here at all. And the learning curve is so fast. And every day we have iPads, and our, we're really blessed our school has supported us. And we have a card of 35 for two hours every day. And it's really useful for differentiation and education because the students who want to go faster can go faster. And the students that need to to rewind it and listen again, they can rewind it and they can work at their own pace. And so the kids that are more advanced can move on faster and it's, it's really helpful that way. And there's so many apps out there for education. Um, so far my impressions are that um, it's the right direction to go. You know, it's real validating to listen to him to explain um, the brain, um, the way the brain works and stuff and, and we're excited to, to get there and try it out now because we feel like, yeah, this is the right step for us. Well, iPads have changed um, our education at schools by giving us um, more like open, like instead of using a dictionary, we can just look it up on the internet, find its definition and meaning. So looking at how do we uh, innovate our classrooms, and, and it's not all just about technology. It's if you have the technology, you could use it to enhance what you're teaching, but it's really looking at teaching in a different manner. How do we show students um, what real life looks like but do it through education. So learning is not about learning, reading, learning, writing. Learning is about learning about content, about learning of concepts. And within that, we learn reading, we learn writing. Using iPads has changed my life because, well, now we know how to experiment on different things by using by using Pablo. And I think that's really changed me because now I know a lot more about science. It's kind of combining these traditions and these things that we hold dear in our culture and in our society, but using technology as a tool to um, access those to kids to be able to promote those to other people to be able to spread the word about those kind of things so the way I look at it the technology is integrating into our society and we need to keep our same values and systems that we have but use technology as a tool to help people find access to those spread knowledge and also just to um, increase engagement and, and access for students. Hands off to all of our science teachers and math teachers and technology experts we heard a lot today about why those areas are so important.